I'm going to read this comment because I like it. Um, my natural testosterone is 1150 at 48 years old. That's, That's really high rare. from what we've seen. That is yeah. really rare this day. My age. physique is very nice. Thank God. My waist is fat and bulky, but my mood and pot potency are not exactly top notch. So I don't know it will be the golden bullet. Check no, your estrogen. Exactly. There are <laughs> so many men out there today who have crazy high estrogen levels, partly because of this chemical influence on our hormones. And it's um, estrone, and the things in the food. estradiol, and total yep. estrogen. And just so bad food. So you capture that xenoestrogen gap. The xeno, yeah. Total estrogens, and then you take away your estrone and estradiol combination, and you see this. We've seen people with this estrogen gap, we call it, where there are total estrogens, which that test measures chemicals that also resemble estrogen. So the total estrogen test will be like 2,000. And then a guy's estrone and estradiol might only total 200. And so there's 1800 points of estrogen that's not real estrogen, but it does have estrogenic effects. It'll cause you to gain fat, to have fatigue, depression, loss of libido, sexual dysfunction. Estrogen is a major problem and it has to be measured. So the guys who have seemingly adequate testosterone and they're having these similar kinds of symptoms and problems that are hormonal, it's usually high estrogen. And that's a separate issue, but it can be addressed and it should be addressed.